Welcome. Oh, all right. On to the next one. All right, Diamond 3, 63 LP. Slowly, slowly but surely climbing. Had a really nice uh, win that last game. Um, I think this might be the last one for today. So, <clears throat> let's see. Really want to go cybernetics or infiltrators and see how it works. I had fun with uh, Sniper's Vanguard, though. Jin is a unit. Um, the Lilac universe has definitely been the most swingy and snowball-y so far. So, we will see. Also, we got this really cute whale, so I'm feeling pretty good. Um, yeah. Let's see what we can do. Mm -hmm. yeah. I feel like Cybernetics is pretty strong right now. I think Sniper Vanguard is pretty strong right now. I feel like those are the two most contested. I think Infiltrator can be pretty good still um, seeing a lot of protector comps still so oh my god this whale it's the lilac nebula again okay uh, maybe we'll go infiltrator huh rod on all these is a little interesting for fizz it can make it into a spark which isn't the worst. Interesting. Rally is also just a really, really good unit. So, I can see that. Velkaz. Velkaz with Rod. That, that might have been the best pick. Um, Lilac Nebula. Alright, I got it two games in a row. Let's see. Let's see what early Fizz could do. Imagine it's a lot of stuff. Oh, this guy's so cute. Literally the cutest. I'm so happy we got him. Got him out of like the Galaxy Pass egg. Yes, I did give Riot ten dollars. Still think it still think it's worth it. Um uh, Um, so yeah, we, we don't have to go Infiltrators here. I mean, getting a Fizz this early is pretty insane for that comp, because you get mech really early. Um, I have to imagine the best item we can make is Spark. Like that. Which is not the best mech item. Huh. So we'll see. Okay, double Malphite. I don't know what we would do with these rods if we went protector. Not super interested in that. I guess we would do this for now. Not sure. Definitely a lilac makes you think. Because you've got a pretty strong unit. The GA is pretty nice. It might actually just slam that. Okay, there's Lucian. I think this is the best we can do, though. Just get Chrono. Could slam the GA. Don't know. That's funny. The last game, people were like really not a fan of the Lilac, but I don't know. But oh, is my least favorite? Oh, I just didn't read that. Yeah, apparently everyone hates this one. I don't know. Let's see how it goes. It's really interesting. I mean, 
makes for really strange starts. Okay. Pick up the fewer here. This is two, three, four, five, eight. This is such an awkward start. We haven't hit any infiltrators. Like even just a Kha'Zix would be really nice here. Could get Sorcerer instead. Ugh. Hmm. Given the item on it, I think Kale and Valkaz were probably the best starts. Okay, we killed one unit at least. <laughs> uh, yeah, we've got some people already moving into Void. This guy's wind streaking early a bit. Okay, well, we're just getting fed cybernetic units. We haven't seen a single other unit, so... What if, for now, we do this? Do this for now. One, two, three, four, five, six... Yeah. Okay, so this is seven, eight, nine, ten. I mean, just having a random fizz for a little bit is probably fine. And this, I didn't see what happened there. It's like a weird bug. Well, we might go cybernetic from this position. The first pick. Uh, grab sword. Could have gone for special for an infiltrator demo. Maybe that was better. Our items are so weird. With two needless, a sword, and a vest. And I'm still figuring out what we're doing. Okay, let's Brawler, Blade Master, Brawler, Chrono, Blaster, Dark Star. Alright, I don't think we can go Infiltrator despite having this Fizz. Well, we'll see. We might want to sell them though, to be honest. I'm gonna leave that option open. Oh, it doesn't feel good, but we're sort of getting our pieces taken away. No one's really that invested in cyber yet, so. Sorry, Jace. Or Jace Fizz. Yeah, just keep getting cyber pieces. Which I'm not going to complain about. I think we're going to make a locket. This is pretty decent early. I mean, what else are we going to do with those? Lock it at level 1 is 250. Not the best, not the worst. Got two swords for our rally late, which is pretty good. Great. So these. Alright, well, this is gonna be interesting because I haven't tried a game where I am uh, transitioning from uh, I 
I haven't done a game where I'm transitioning from like not all ending on the lilac unit, so this should be interesting. Yeah, this this sorcerer brawler comp with Velkos seems pretty good. I really want to try that at some point. Just get money here, it looks like. And one item. Belt. Okay. Got lost? Oh, that's pretty bad. <laughs> Fizz in our shop. I guess we can probably just move them back line. Just move them back here. Um could make a Morella for Echo later. Can't think what else this would be. Let's go for it. We gotta make these items work for us. Um, or else we're gonna be really weak in the mid game here. Oh, Ezreal, get your ults. Yes. Good, good, good. Oh, this Velkaz hurts. Oh, we're winning. Hey, hey. Not too bad. Nice. Interesting, there's a kill. Could pick it up. I don't think it matters that much though. And we're just trying to level. Yeah, this guy's kill stacking. Two sword comps doing different things. I like our spot currently. I think we are going to end up being the only like six piece cybernetic player. Oh, this kill hurts. Oh, it's not going to kill her either. Okay. We'll see. These are not great items for uh, cybernetic. Usually you want more gloves, you want more vests. Still not sure if slamming the locket was the right play. I think this is the right play, although it's really bad on tier two Fiora. Um, anything we can pick up here? Not really. Just put Graze in there. So, um, Typically the way you play this comp, yeah, this guy went right into Infiltrators anyway and got the demo spat. Typically, um, the way you play this comp is you rush 8, you need Echo at 8, you need Tier 2 Aurelia. Um, the two wins that I've had off Cybernetics and Diamond have been Tier 3 Aurelius, so that's definitely good. Um, yeah, that guy's strong. I think it's good we pivoted out, though. I think if we had tried to contest this guy, we would have been in way worse shape. So he, just, he had the tier item. We could have taken the demo spat. That's a, that's a tough call, I think. Okay. Here was second pick. I think it's glove, then vest. Looks like that guy's going to go for glove on Soraka. No. Okay. Yeah, I'll pick up the IE here for Relia. Can probably pick up the bow later for the armor pen item. Which I think we're gonna want. We'll see. Yeah, if there's a protector. Yeah, I don't want to. A lot of sword comps. See how we stack up. There's the bow line. I'll throw the IE on uh, Ezreal for now. Hmm. 
four starter and four sorcerer. Let's see, I got two chrono. That guy's pretty strong. We are pretty weak. Our items are like fine, but we're pretty weak. Good loss. Especially if we get another unit. Hell yeah. Okay. Great. Farming loss, Jake. We're losing very slowly. Ho oh, ho ho. Hell. Hell to the yeah, yeah. Because we don't even lose Blaster here. Just slam that on her. I'm just going to do this. I could pick up the Jace for Vanguard, but one thing I've learned is that if you're really trying to econ like to the fullest to get the best rolls for level 8, is you shouldn't buy a unit that's going to mess up your econ. Just put in another level 1 unit that you know you're going to keep, because um, you're better off doing that. Then if I buy Jace, right, I go down to 47 gold, there's no possible way I get the extra gold off that round. And then I have a random Jace, yeah, which maybe makes me my comp a little stronger, but I just need gold, you know. I mean, I need life. This this hit sucks. Like, this guy's very strong, but with cybernetics, you really, in my opinion, I, I think you just prioritize rushing eight, and that's that's it. If we can dodge first place a bit, like, that loss hurts for sure. Also, if we get any level ups on our units, that would be Pretty ideal. Let's see what everyone's working with. Interesting. Blade Master Valkyrie comp. I haven't really seen stuff like that before. This protector player is really low on items. This guy's probably going to be strong, although he's in class right now. Okay. Now here's the question, <laughs> we could go Hodge and then leave the sword up for maybe a, I think that's the play, we leave the sword up for either another IE or GA, yeah, I think I'd go like this. Let me just put this on our Leona for now. Sure. Hopefully we can just not dip below like 30 health, but it's going to be tough. We, we might. Oh, can we win this with Fiora? Still kills us through parry. That's feels a little weird. There are three sword comps. Wow, I think, right? I know there's two. The two brawler. Two brawler comps. This kale's pretty scary. So just a bunch of level 1 units. Uh, this is all going to come down to level 8, as it almost always does. And it's nice when you can snowball early with uh, cybernetics. But can't do that every time. Okay. Probably not going to kill anyone. That sucks. 40. 39, okay. We are farming this lost streak. Okay, we can start rolling here. Okay, that's big. Okay.
just stop there for now. We got this? Yes. Okay. No echo. No vest. Could just pick up triple IE. It's tough. I chose this because the armor pen item. I'm not sure if that's right, actually. Potentially infiltrator spat too. It leaves us open to two, I think, better items than another IE. We'll see. Um, do I buy this upgrade? I think so. Need to roll a little bit here. Okay. Do I need to hit Echo? We killed Kale on the back line. Shell here for now. Let's put in. Let's put in another MF. <laughs> uh, I can just move these guys up this front line. What else have? I think in retrospect, Echo was the pick on the carousel. tough. Really too. Uh, did I sell these for econ? No, because I still need them for when we get Echo, because we're going to sell Fiora and put uh, Morello on her. So we're reasonably strong now, but we really need to... Getting tier 2 MF is pretty good. Even with no items, she just does so much damage with the uh, upgrades. Okay. We'll see what items we get. I think we should get like two. Maybe two items, three items. Still need to transfer this stuff. It'd be great to get a tier 2 buy, get a bigger shield on the back line. <laughs> Not that much, but uh, it's gold. Oh boy. No items. Okay, it's pretty bad. Might be a giant slayer illusion, which doesn't feel good. Okay. Come on, Echo. Oh, OK. 
Okay. Our guy was just CC'd the whole time. Do we win this still? Wow. That's surprising. That's really surprising. This lobby is very close. Wow. All right. We have to start paying attention to matchups and see if we can... Echo, I know you're in here. <laughs> Might have to just transfer that to MF. Let's see. Demo spec. Kaisa is so good. Yeah, this guy just destroyed us. Yeah, this guy's very strong. Near perfect items on Kaisa. This carousel has to be good to us for us to win this. Thank you. Okay. Okay, that's a big power spike for us. Go like this. Looks like we're winning this. Nice. Nice. Okay. Found the echo. All right. All right. We just need a good item, third item for Aurelia. That's really what we're looking for. Or if we get, like, um, Thief's Glove to put on MF, that's probably the best pick if it's there. Okay. You know what we need for Aurelia. was the armor pen item I was thinking about building earlier. It could also be QSS. But I think she just... We, we need it against the protector player. And it helps against this guy too. Uh, it's actually tough because like... So does QSS. I think it's really close... Slayer on MF, I think. Don't face that guy. I'll do that. Do a little switch map. Okay, let's see. Okay, well, we killed the Zinzao. That's pretty good for us, I think. Oh, really? CC'd for so long. Nice. Second. Sell Lulu. I mean, I would love to get a Vi too. this guy uh, see how this goes okay we killed Kaisa that's huge okay okay 
We lose this still. Damn. Did we lose? Ugh, close. Damn, that sucks that we got paired against first place again. Ginsu's. <sighs> Alright. Hmm. Do we put it on Echo or MF? I actually, th I actually think it's MF. She's doing a lot of damage in these fights. And we don't have Echo 2. <sighs> if we get a couple champion upgrades, we can top 4 this. But it's really unlucky that we got paired against this guy like multiple times. Still haven't seen most of the other players. Let's see what we can hit. Or just some upgrades on MF would be good too. We can get them. Okay. Nice. Okay. Those those are some upgrades for sure. Um let's do some switching here. MF is in a good spot. Oh, he's got the demo. MF ult. Nice. We knock him out. Okay. Okay, top four. All right. Always just hoping to get the top four. What a strange game. God, starting out with Fizz. Top three. Hell yes. All right. Not bad. Um, still just rolling for Echo and Aurelia. Okay. All right. So we've played this guy literally three times. I'm gonna hope we're not doing it. So I'm gonna position for this guy. Um, sort of a similar <laughs> formation. Wait, my F MF's better. <laughs> oh my god, he's at one health. Oh. Question is, are we playing him again? Yeah, let's roll. We can't really roll for anything else, can we? I'm going to hope this is the same guy. He's grouping on the right side? Interesting. I meant to switch Echo. Ah, oh, no. We lose. Oh, man. If it was the other guy, we, we have this. MF just can't do enough work by herself, I don't think. Alt. Alright, I'll take third place. Alright, yeah, all well, this was a weird game, but uh, we sort of got there. So, alright. Thank you for joining. That was a weird cybernetics game.